one that fits you like a glove. Greetings. You look like someone who would know how to use a blade. If you're looking for the best steel, you're in the right place. Weapons, armors, ammunition, I have it all. And if you have a special request, my associates will be glad to make it for you. Want armor that fits you like it? Oh, it's a great. I'm currently investigating an extortion case involving the guard. Are you one of the merchants who has been threatened? <coughs> no, not at all. And I've never heard of this business. Someone must have lied to you. Really? Come on. If you want these guards to be arrested, you need to talk to me. I mean no offense, but you won't be able to do anything. And snitching don't end well. I want to hold on to my business and my life. How about some new armor, Your Excellency? I was told that someone found a merchant's body. Did you know him? Of course. The town isn't that big. We all know each other here. Poor Reno. We found his body on the street by the port. He was beaten to death. One of his associates half-heartedly took over the shop. Have the culprits been found? No. Listen, nobody wants to talk about this. We don't want any trouble. It's been months since it happened. An investigation's not gonna bring him back. You were obviously a victim of these bandits. One of your people is dead. Yet you refuse to help me. Why? It's precisely because one of our people is dead. Now, you can either buy something or let me get back to work. Because I'm not going to say one more word about this case. The law of silence you like a glove. We'll Nobody make it saw for anything. You. Nobody knows anything. Come closer, good... Madam, I am pleased to welcome you to the best wine and spirit shop in Tierfredi. If you're looking for something to accompany a fine meal, or for a gift for someone, you've come to the right place. Thank you, but I'm not here for that. I am conducting an investigation. Some merchants are being extorted by members of the Guard. Uh, are you sure? It's probably just a nasty rumor. Someone must have misinformed you. Come now. I am the Legate of the Congregation. If Guards threaten you, I could arrange protection for you. Threats? No. I assure you. I was told a merchant had been found dead. Really? Oh, I didn't know. No one told me about that. What was his name? Come on. Don't take me for a fool. You know very well who I'm talking about. I don't. Really? I don't. So, what sort of wine would you like to pair your food with? You need something strong when eating game? You're obviously terrified. Don't you think it's better to tell me everything? Listen, I've no desire to get into trouble. Please leave me. But if you don't help me, you will never be rid of these guards. I told you, I don't know what you're talking about. You'll find all you need in a... Excellency, welcome back to my modest shop. It is an immense honor for me to be of service to such noble clientele. What might I do for you? I am conducting an investigation. Apparently some merchants are being extorted by some members of the Guard. Really? That's... that's terrible, Your Excellency. As Legate, it is my duty to ensure the safety and well-being of the citizens of our town. So please, if you have any information, I... I don't know anything. Really. I have only been here for a few months. My partner, who ran the shop before me, had a very bad encounter. 
And you fear the same thing happening to you. This is what happens around here. So I prefer to hold my tongue and do what is expected of me. If you denounce them, we could end this and charge these men for their crime. I can't take that risk. There are so many of them. Also, I would not be able to name them. Now, I would like to get back to my work. What we need is the money to return, do you understand? We are very... monitored. I have a plan to stop the culprits, but I'm going to need your help. The next time one of these guards comes to squeeze money out of you, you must ask for more time. The man will threaten you, of course, and he will certainly bring his accomplices. But when they come back in full force to make you pay for your audacity, we will be there to apprehend them. And if your plan fails, I'll end up like Renault. You don't understand. Are you not tired of giving them a share of your profits? And do you not want to avenge your partner? He was my friend, and his death really upset me. But I don't want to end up like him. Sorry, Your Excellency. And what if I gave you money to pay for it? If the plan fails, you only have to give them that money. They have no interest in getting rid of those who earned them so much. You are not wrong. Very well. I will do what you ask of me. But for God's sake, when they threaten me, intervene right away. Fear not. We will not let them harm you. When should they be returning? It's hard to predict. Given their habits, I would say... in two days, maybe? Perfect. I will not fail you. Thank you for your visit. See you soon.